part two, Dollar Tree. I forgot most of my stuff. I am so tired, so let's go through this again, you guys. Part two. Mom's Kitchen Hot and Fresh. Faith, family, friends, and food. Love this. It'll go right in the kitchen just fine. I grabbed two packs of these sick packs, so there, there's 12 of them. And I thought this would be great for my family. We are thinking about going somewhere to see the fireworks since we didn't get to last year. Something different. My bathroom, I repainted it. Always wash your hands. Flush the toilet, close the lid, and floss and brush your teeth. I'm going to put that. Yep, let's show them what you got. You got two latex balloons. And they look pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. So we'll get those to Daddy. Or you got to find Solomon. I got tablecloths if you follow my hauls. I have hauled these before, but I wanted to grab two extra because we got sick Memorial Day and I did use some because we didn't want to miss out on the party just because we were tested positive. Uh, great dads <laughs> are like barbecue. Kind of tough on the outside, but tender and juicy on the inside. Happy Father's Day. My brothers are twins, and then I have my dad and my husband's dad. Dad, you mean so much. Beautiful. Thanks to you, Dad. I always felt like I could do anything if I tried hard enough. I am so grateful for your strength, stability, and love. Happy Father's Day. Go give it to Solomon, Phoebe, or Priscilla, okay? Hope today makes you say it doesn't get any better this way. Because that's just the kind of day you deserve. Happy Father's Day. Then you're one of a kind dad. And I'm so glad I'm your pup. Happy Father's Day. Then we have a graduation coming up. We only have one this year. Oh, man, it says we are so happy for you. Your graduation day must be one of the proudest days in your life. And you... We couldn't be happier for you as you move to new, exciting, new things. Our thoughts and good wishes are with you, too. Congratulations. So that's super cute. Hallmark, of course. Um, last but not least here. I did not take these out of the bag yet. Our silverware walks away, so I like to keep some on hand. Plus, my husband takes lunches to work. These are really sturdy, too. Just FYI. Um... So if you need silverware, they're not like cheap and flimsy. So I grabbed some spoons. Boy, did I grab spoons. I'm not sure why I grabbed so many. I thought maybe they were forks and stuff. This is what happens when you don't go to bed till four in the morning. Then I seen this there and I thought maybe my girls would like to try that. Or I'd give this to my 13 year old niece, shaving soap and a sponge. Her hands are really raw to my nieces due to, uh, Living on a farm and doing farm chores, so I think this is a good brand. Um, she has really long, thick hair, so we grabbed those. Oh, this is a thanks for our dog. Our dog. We love our dog. Hair are things, more for her or for me. I'm growing my hair out, too, and my 13-year-old also has long hair. And utter... Lee, smooth. I know this is good hand cream. Plus, now my 13-year-old daughter is also saying her legs are super itchy. So, I do have some lotion on hand. That is all of my haul, I promise, this time. And we shall see you in our next clip. Goodbye.